Hi guys, welcome back. Okay, so I'm doing my BoxyCharm unboxings a little bit different this month. Um, as you can see, I have both of my boxes, my regular and my premium, I believe. And yeah, so I'm just going to open my boxes for October. I thought I'd do it like this and just show you guys the products. Quite frankly, I didn't feel like getting out of my jammies. And yeah, that's basically why. <laughs> so... Yeah, so let's go ahead and start with the main box. I did go ahead and open it up so I didn't have to struggle with it. And I did take a peek. So I already know what's in here. But I thought I'd go ahead and share it just in case somebody's curious. So let's go ahead and open her up and see what's happening for October. So this is the card. It says Candy Shop. Okay, very cute. Got the little candy on there and i have variation 30 so let's go ahead and check this box out i'm gonna go ahead and turn it this way because you know y'all be liking to cheat y'all can't cheat i don't want y'all trying to see what's up in here <laughs> okay so this first item here is from dose of colors this is meet your hue full coverage concealer okay nice little black box with the shiny writing on there so let's see what they sent me. I have 28 deep. Let's see what it looks like. I think this is one of the, or the item that I chose, if I'm remembering correctly. This looks darker than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> it really does. This is what the deep, what I say, 28 deep looks like. So yeah, it is pretty dark. But I'm thinking... I don't know. I'm thinking, yeah, that is pretty dark. Ooh, chow. Mmm. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe I can use it to conceal dark circles underneath my foundation. But yeah, that is pretty dark. A lot darker than I go for concealer, obviously. And it's even a little dark to use, like, as a foundation. You know what I mean? So, anyway, we'll have to check that out and see. How this works for me I might just use it to spot conceal and hopefully it works dose of colors meet your hue concealer this multitasking full coverage concealer has a lightweight easy to blend formula it conceals dark under eye circles there you go uh, blemishes and other skin imperfections retails for $24 okay next I have here what looks like some brushes yeah these are brushes from Luxie in this cute little package here very cute cute little case it says Luxie on there and I like the fact that it's all black and not any like crazy colors and these are the brushes now these are pretty really pretty kind of like lavender or is that periwinkle I don't know but anyways this is what those look like so it is a set of five and one of them is a spoolie type brush but it's only a spoolie brush it doesn't have double ended like a lot of the you know eyebrow brushes do so that kind of sucks but very cool so a nice little five piece brush set from luxie let's see what it says about this so it says luxie wonderlust set create eye-catching looks with this five piece rose gold synthetic brush set okay so yeah the ferrule is rose gold the versatile collection includes a taper shading brush blending brush medium angle brush large shader brush plus a brow and a lash brush stash them in your luxie pouch for glam on the go retails for 40 dollars okay so yeah i mean you know they're cute i don't know if i'd pay 40 dollars for these probably not but they're uh, very cute, very handy, so I will be checking those out. Or maybe I'll just save them for travel because this is a cute little case. Okay, so let's see what we got next. Oh, okay, lip product here. This is from Sol de Janeiro Brazilian Kiss Tinted Capacho Lip Butter. Keep it real. Okay, keep it real. <laughs> That's cute. Keep it real. I like that picture on the side, very nice. Okay, so let's open her up, see what's happening. Even though you pretty much can see what it looks like <laughs> from the picture. 
but oh so cute look at that packaging that is really really cute okay okay so yeah that's what it looks like and you know lip like the what is it called the lip balms stuff like that has been like all the rage right now so I'm not surprised that this is in here I mean I have over the last month or so purchased so many lip balms it's not even funny so this is a lip butter so I'll see how I like this well let's see what this retails for Sol de Janeiro Brazilian kiss tinted lip butter a soft tinted lip treatment that pampers lips with a delicious blend of cook Kapow, I cannot pronounce that. Is a Kapow Q butter, a sigh, and coconut oil. Cushiony, soft, and super conditioning for lip loving benefits that transform dry rub lips into your most kissable with the scrumptious aroma of Dose de Leite. Dose de Leite? $20. Retails for $20. Let me see. I didn't even smell it. Let me see what's happening here. Oh yeah, it does have a nice kind of like tropical coconutty scent, I guess. So, you know, Sol de Janeiro, they love their scented stuff. So, very nice, very nice. Okay, got some Ace Beauty Draw It Lip Liners in here. So, this is a duo, a duo, and what is it? Let's see. Ooh, that concealer is getting darker and darker. <laughs> what I'm gonna do with that okay so these are the lip liners from Ace Beauté if you can see that it's kind of hard at this angle but these are the colors looks like a red and kind of like a caramel toffee shade so let's see what it says about these so this is what they look like Okay, so it says Ace Beauté Draw It Lip Liner Duo. The Draw It Lip Liners are super pigmented liners that draw on smoothly and can be used to line the lips or fill them in completely. It includes a sharpener at the base that can be used to sharpen the liner's tip. Retails for $16. Okay, I'm glad that I read that because you know sometimes you don't even know. Okay, so yeah, this is like a little sharpener for the actual lip liner. Very cool. Very cool, nice and handy. Let me see something. Yeah, that's very, very light. I don't even know if you can see that. <laughs> Definitely for a nude lip. And that color is really pretty though. Yeah, that one's really pretty. The other one is basic, it's definitely basically a nude, but the red is really pretty. And they feel really creamy. Okay, and then lastly for my base box, I have a palette. I have this cute little Beauty Bakery Breakfast in Bed palette. Very, very cute. Very cute. Look at that packaging. So cute. I have seen this palette already um, all over the tube, and it's not really my cup of tea but it is a really pretty palette though, even though it's not really my cup of tea. So these are the colors in this palette. So you see, it's very pretty. Just a nice, it's kind of like a basic palette, but with a twist, because it has like those purpley, kind of, you know, burgundy type tones in there to give you like a little bit of, you know, extra pop instead of just being a regular neutral or brown palette. So I think it's very cute, actually. So let me see what it says about this. Beauty Bakery Breakfast in Bed Eyeshadow Palette. Um, delightful morning medley of saturated mattes and shimmery shadows. Be a closer look. <laughs> uh, this palette is perfect for the classic office to happy hour transition transitional touch-up okay retails for $38 so yeah very cute actually if I was going to get a kind of basic neutral type palette I would want one like this so very very cute I like it not mad at all okay so that is everything from my base box let's go ahead and take a look at my premium Okay, so this is my premium, nice big box. 
And like I said, I did already peek inside my boxes. So I know that for my premium, I'm actually missing an item and I had to request for them to replace it because they forgot a whole item in here. But this one has the same theme, of course, Boxy Charm Candy Shop. And it is variation number three. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a look. I don't want y'all peeking. I don't want y'all cheating. <laughs> I don't really think you could see it anyway. So let me just move it over here a little bit. Okay, so this first item here on top is from Kosa. So it says Lip Fuel Kosa Sport. This is a hyaluronic lip balm. I don't know why if this whole not for resale on here, that kind of like makes me feel like, is this a sample? Like, was this a giveaway or something that they just threw in these boxes? I don't know. Anyway, this is from Kosa Sport. It is a lip balm. Let's see what it says here. Kosa Sport Lip Fuel, an ultra hydrating hyaluronic lip balm delivering advanced lip care powered by active botanicals that transport you to a sport state of mind. And it retails for $18. <laughs> yeah, okay, whatever. So yeah, another lip balm. Like I said, lip balms are all the rage right now. So not mad at it, but definitely not going to open that because I have about a million lip balms right now. Okay, so another lip product. This is from Laura Geller. 50 Kisses Lip Lock Lip Locking Liquid Color. <laughs> Say that fast 10 times. Uh, this is Mer. What does it say? Makeout Merlot. Makeout Merlot. Very pretty. Very very pretty color. Yeah. Okay. So let's see what it says about this. <sighs> Laura Geller, Fifty Kisses Lip Locking Liquid Color. No more air kisses. Our pure pigment formula stays true with soft satiny color that stays put from morning peck to midnight smooch. The uniquely curved applicator hugs lips for a precise application. The built-in well delivers the perfect amount of color with each application. Okay, retails for $21. 21 Zolas, okay. So this is what that looks like, if you can see that. And let me just swatch it right here. That's a pretty color. It's just kind of like your basic, you know, burgundy wine like merlot type shade very pretty not too too dark though very nice shade okay 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 next here i have a skincare item go to exfoliating swipes it says foolproof exfoliating pads for glowing skin and I'm really excited to get this actually because I love exfoliating products. If you guys don't already know that, I love products that exfoliate my face. It says here we all need some magic swipey pad thingies. <laughs> That's cute. Swipey pad thingies, really? Okay. So this is what it looks like. It comes in this cute little peach type jar. Hopefully there's a seal on here. Nope no seal okay smells nice though yeah smells like nice kind of light gentle citrusy smell i guess i don't know but that's what it looks like i'm surprised there's no seal on there but you know with boxy charm you never know okay so it says go to skincare exfoliating swipies Single-use exfoliating pads soaked in an all-natural solution get rid of dead skin cells and hydrate the skin. The well-documented effectiveness of lactic acid, the most gentle of all AHAs, is combined with ultra-hydrating essential oils to create a face exfoliator that thoroughly removes dead skin cells. Uh, let's see. Refines skin texture, minimizes the appearance of fine lines, and deeply moisturizes. Retails for $35. Okay, so not bad. Okay, so I'm not mad at that. Let's see here. Okay, this is from Murad Hydration Hydrating Toner. Uh, I'm really glad I got this because I actually... 
well, I don't necessarily need a new toner. I have some other toners to use, but I was kind of wanting another toner. <laughs> so I'm happy that I got this and I don't have to buy one. So very cool. And it's from Murad. So it says here, an ultra hydrating alcohol free toner, instantly balances skin, natural pH while lifting impurities to enhance the benefits of treatments that follow. Sodium PCA helps replenish lost moisture while chamomile and cucumber extracts soothe the skin. Retails for $35, okay. Very, very nice. I'm very happy about that. And lastly, I had this palette which is the Illuminati times Issa, I guess. Never heard of Issa, but yeah. So I got this palette and I'm pretty sure you guys have seen this. I know I've seen other people getting this, um, I believe in their premium box. And let's see here, let me go ahead and show this to you before I tell you guys what item that I actually have missing out of my box. But this is what the palette looks like. Try not to blind you. It's actually quite pretty, but I don't know. You know how when you look at palettes and, you know, if you're like really familiar with different eyeshadows, you can kind of just look at a palette and tell that it's not going to be that pigmented. <laughs> That's how I feel about this. I feel like the colors are really pretty, but yeah, I don't really have high hopes for the pigmentation on this. And plus it has like, you know, glitter in here that I'm not excited about. This shadow here looks really, really pretty though. It looks like some type of duochrome or something. Really gorgeous. This gold looks pretty. But yeah, I don't like this glitter that's in here. But yeah, so this is the palette that I got. So let me see what it says about this. It says here, Illuminati Cosmetics Times Issa Eyeshadow Palette. They've collaborated with Isabel Badoya for an ultra versatile palette. Create an evening glam look or perfect daytime look. The shades range from pastels to bright colors and neutrals. There's a look for every person. Retails for $48. So yeah, I don't know if I would pay $48 for this. Probably not. But um, yeah, I guess it's cool to get in the boxy charm to try it out. So yeah, that was the last item that I actually have in my box. Now the item that I have on my little paper here that I'm missing is the Kosas Tinted Face Oil Foundation. So it says that that is a clean, featherweight light coverage foundation and hydrating skin elixir with application that takes as little as 10 seconds. The breathable formula, even skin tone, minimizes pores and erases imperfections while supporting a skin health. Retails for $42. So like I said, I did contact Boxy so that they can send me my foundation, even though it doesn't really sound like the type of foundation that I typically use because y'all know I'm a full coverage chick. I want my foundation because it's supposed to be in my box. <laughs> so yeah, so this is my whole little premium situation right here. And quite frankly, this is not what I would consider a premium box it's just not but you know it is what it is I'm not stressing today you know <sighs> it is what it is so yeah let me give you an update on that concealer that's what it looks like dries down pretty dark so I don't know what I'm gonna do with that <laughs> the lipstick yeah it's drying down pretty good but it's still a little bit wet as you can see the lip liners do those yeah, that definitely transferred. The lip liner does. But yeah, so that is it, you guys, for my BoxyCharm boxes. Hopefully you didn't mind this little different kind of setup. Like I said, I just, I didn't feel like getting dressed today. So this is what we have. <laughs> so yeah, thanks so much for watching and I will see you on my next one. Toodles!